treatment of urinary stones and most of the urinary tract diseases. Usually there are three lines of treatment. Conservative medical treatment, instrumental treatment by UT endoscopy, nephroscopy, cystoscopy, urethroscopy, etc. Uh, and open surgery. What is the indication of medical treatment? Sure, as usual, uh, if there is silent stone or silent disease without complication, treatment by conserved treatment. Um, for a stone disease, if the stone is small, less than half centimeter, uncomplicated stone, conserved treatment is the line of treatment. Why? Because if the stone is less than a half centimeter, sure this stone will pass spontaneously in at least 90% of cases. What is uh, the method of medical treatment? First of all, dietary advice. Dietary advice the patient should ensure high fluid intake at least four liter per day to make the urine a diluted solution and prevent precipitation of crystal because if the urine is saturated or hypersaturated this is the first step of stone formation sure uh, according to urine analysis and according to analysis of any stone bust from the patient, we know the type of the stone and we should advise the patient to completely avoid the food rich in crystals responsible for his or her stone. Therefore, if example patient uh, have uh, uric acid stone. You should restrict uh, red dark meat, uh, any uh, food rich in purines which is responsible for formation of uric acid. Which uh, usually these uh, purines uh, present in dark meat, red meat, uh, geese. Uh, ducks. Um, a specific measure according to the type of the stone. Change the pH of urine. We all know that oxalate and uric acid stones precipitate in acidic urine. Prevent precipitation. By prevent acidity of urine. How to prevent acidity of urine? Make the urine alkaline. By citrates. Give the patient evervescence two or three times daily to make the urine always alkaline to prevent precipitation of calcium oxalate and uric acid stone. In reverse, to calcium phosphate and strobite stones, which precipitate in alkaline urine. Therefore, never make the urine alkaline, make the urine acidic by one gram vitamin C by day per day this will make the urine acidic and prevent precipitation of strobite and the calcium phosphate for uh, phosphate stones prevent absorption of phosphates from the GIT how give the patient aluminum hydroxide orally aluminum hydroxide orally will prevent and restrict phosphate absorption for uric acid stone prevent the formation of uric acid in the body how to prevent formation of uric acid in the body by famous drug xyloric 300 milligram per day will restrict and prevent formation of uric acid in the body. 
Beside dietary advice uh, and special uh, measures according to the sun, if uh, there is severe pain, give the analgesics and antispasmodics if needed. Urinary tract antiseptics are very important to prevent infection. And regular follow-up weekly by ultrasound to monitor the descent of the stone. One time you make the ultrasound, you will find the no stones, which means spontaneous descent of the smallest stones. If conserved treatment fails, a small uncomplicated stone, but medical treatment and conserved treatment fails. Instrumental treatment is the solution and is the treatment. Instrumental treatment include, I said before in the investigation, that endoscopies are diagnostic and therapeutic. For example, extraction of the stones through a nephroscope or a urethroscope or through a cystoscope. This is an instrumental treatment. Indicated if the same indication of conservative, a small and complicated stone, but with failure of conserved treatment. Finally, open surgery. What is the indication of open surgery? Large stones, complicated stones, or failure of medical and instrumental treatment. Finally, as a rule, uh, in all UT disease, how you manage a case with hopeless kidney function? First of all, management of a case with hopeless kidney function in any UT disease. First of all, how to diagnose hopeless kidney, complete destruction of the kidney. We diagnose uh, hopeless kidney function and we suspect the hopeless kidney function and complete destruction in, in view infusion urography. You give urographene, which is a contrast material diluted in saline over 15 minutes to give the patient a chance to concentrate and excrete the dye. No dye excretion. Plus ultrasound. Ultrasound show very thin paper sickness for the Arabic student, they lower a result. Renal brink. Very thin renal brinkma means the destruction of the kidney. Radioactive isotopic scanning. Radioactive isotopic scanning show zero function. Treatment. What is the treatment of uh, this condition according to the other kidney? If there is hopeless kidney and the other kidney is completely normal, total nephrectomy should be done. Why? Because from the hopeless kidney, descending infection to the urinary bladder and urethra may be followed by ascending infection to the other normal kidney, leading to destruction of the other kidney. Therefore, if normal kidney, and you should save this normal kidney by total nephrectomy of the diseased hopeless kidney. The major problem if there is hopeless kidney with bad other kidney. What is the solution? I can't remove this kidney. The kidney, the bad kidney may have one percent, two percent, ten percent function. This may lead to decrease at least frequency of dialysis in this case of renal failure. Therefore, if there is hopeless kidney, with bad other kidney, one of the following should be considered. First of all, nephrostomy. Make a drainage, opening for drainage of the pelvic cell system. And we try to give antibiotic and by drainage of the pelvic cell system, 
and by relieving of bad condition in this kidney and the back pressure on this kidney, the renal function may improve. And if renal function becomes improving and no renal failure, the nephrostomy can be withdrawn. And this case, nephrostomy will be temporary nephrostomy. But if the condition remain, we give antibiotic and by the best drainage of the pelvic system, the same. Nephrostomy will be permanent nephrostomy. If there is uremia and renal failure, sure this patient should live on dialysis uh, until dialysis until renal transplantation become available. This is uh, the management, diagnosis and treatment of hopeless kidney in any UT disease. These are the general principles in renal stones and in any UT diseases. Thank you for good listening and good luck.